an episode of Victoria Too Hard Darkness, the Panab Let's Play. So guys, I've been messing around a little bit and doing some calculations about the future war with the United Kingdom. Um, basically, I think we can win as long as they don't call in the little Indian allies. If they call in the little Indian allies, we're dead. Okay, they did not call in any of the allies. That's good. Alright, so then we definitely have a chance to win this. We just have to make sure we play very, very smartly. So let's get all of our infantry up. Start having our people mobilized at the minute. Move these guys over here. Move these guys over there. And now we just wait it out. Because most likely what's going to happen is they're going to move right there to, to Fear Goldberg. Let's see. And we also need to make sure. Is this, does this cost belly wear off over time? No, I'm going to have to fight him to a submission. Which I don't know. I don't know. I wish I could declare status quo, like, right now. This would be perfect timing to declare status quo. Okay, you guys move over there. Uh, yeah, we have to make sure we have some defenses mounted. Okay, yeah, we look pretty defensible. Okay, so basically, guys, our strategy here, make sure we don't die, is to not die. And actually, to move out of my own capital, because my capital is actually death trap. Um, that sounds really bad, but my de capital is a death trap. If I use my capital as a, uh, we support our men. While we still have money, I will support them. Um, it's a death trap because so many, okay, you guys can go right there. Because basically, um, watch. The, actually, this is, this could lead to a very, very lucrative a very very lucrative trap we send let's see let's see these guys oh they don't know what's gonna hit him I'm just gonna hit him with like everyone 26 let's see you guys could get there 30th 27th just everyone swarm this one troop I think most of these guys have yeah most of these guys have attack modifiers so this will be a mate so let's see will they still go for it Yep, they're still going to go for it. Nope, they changed directions. Now they're going for Bastia. Bastia. They're not going for Molten. They're definitely not moving where I thought they would. Let's see. You guys are moving to Sissinger. Gonna keep my man around here. So yeah, if you guys aren't moving to where I think you guys are moving. Yeah, you guys move to Ashinger. I don't know where that is, actually. Kuwait, Kuwait. Uh, yeah, I don't know where that is. So I'm just going to keep my man... Still around here, but not quite in the way. You guys right there. Okay, let's go. Whew. Oh. I guess that's where Assinger is. Luckily, that's a way more defensible area than my own capital. Which means we can actually deal with it. So, all these men should be able to deal with that one troop. And definitely with the attack bonuses... But we have, it should be able to crush whatever, yeah, there we go, we won our first victory, um, I'm going to use this army, I know it's taking nutrition, but I'm going to use this army to go heal up my men, actually you guys can just stay right there, I'm not heal it up, we conquest some of our own land, okay, they're re-attacking us, these guys are going for over here, so Scylla, okay, let's see, what kind of, Go all the way down to speed one. I want to see what we're hitting. We're hitting a thousand to one three hundred. That's good. That means we're hitting more than what they're killing us. Okay, so if I were to send in, I would send in these guys to just wrap it up. A good 2.0. Yeah, this would be. Just go use it to morally destroy them should be enough. I don't think that army to the left of me is going to be able to come away with a win. Uh, yeah, that should definitely turn the tide of that battle. Um, looks like we have another battle right here going on. Uh, we're going to finish up con conquering back some of our land. Oy, these are actually pretty tense battles. Oy, that one's really getting close. Okay, you guys go right here, then go right there. Wait. Wait, I wonder if these guys will break off if I send in more men. Nope, they seem to be stubborn enough to stay in there. Well, 
Look at this, Great Britain. Ha 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 ha. Look how much men I have. Look. Okay, we have this finished up. Let's see if we can... Can we go help any of these? Well, this one's just out of reach now. It's just... It's gonna lose no matter what I do. Because that's just way too many men. I can't even fight that on my own day. Okay. This guy... This is our only battle where I'm just so bad... So mad... So happy that they did not do anything right. Okay. We'll be able to send in our men. We just have to kill them quickly enough. Just stay alive, men. Just stay alive. You just have to stay alive. Yeah, these guys are getting slaughtered. Oh my goodness, they just got slaughtered. Okay, over here, we're about to win this. Okay, we just covered our butts. Okay, I'm going to go send in some more people over here. I'm going to go spread out on the line a little bit. Alright, over there, they seem to have 70 troops there in just the middle. That is amazing. And we haven't even really made a dent into the army. But at least we're negatively affecting their war score. That is always good. In fact, let's actually just keep... doing what we're doing which is just reconquesting all land that has been lost to us so I think that's actually a very smart idea okay furniture factory we lost a battle that actually puts them in positive but they're about to lose a battle so that should be negative actually in fact, I'll make sure they lose this battle <laughs> it's kind of overkill but we have to make sure and I'm sending some more troops to go kick out the uh, Uh, the uh, forces so yeah this is actually a pretty good start okay yeah this army's probably gonna be hunted down and killed not doubting that not much we could have done either they did lose a lot could we possibly do no if we do that it's gonna affect us even more we're gonna be killing this army over here so we'll, I think we're actually gonna arrive there before they do let's see they're gonna arrive there Sissinger is gonna arrive there the 10th Ah, uh, no, we're not. They're going to slightly beat us to there, but we're going to have instant attack on them. They have no morale, really. And so this is this is still going to just just, just going to be like a slaughter. Or maybe an advanced skill that I have not mastered yet. Okay, so let's see. We have 215. A pre-damaged unit. I'm going to try to send them over here. Actually, I'm going to send them a little whore. Maybe bait them again into try to attacking me. Because we need to make sure our units can heal up. As you can see, this is going to end in pretty badness. They're going to destroy that unit. I'm pretty sad about that, but there's not much I could have done. I win that battle, they're going to destroy this unit right over here. Well, at least we got our revenge. Yeah, that's, it's just like offset each other, but I should still be winning in the long run. Yep, still winning in the long run. Oi. And my army may be a little bit depleted, but we're still giving the British a hard time. Um... We still got tons of troops that we can deploy too. That's a good thing. That's the reason why I got that whole modifier with my own troops. And I actually should be using wartime taxes. I don't know why I wasn't doing this because we don't want to attract too much inf uh not infamy, but lazy spending. No, that's not the word. Um, money issues, budget crisis, bad. There, that's the basic syllables you need to make the sentence I want to make. Okay, here's some more men. Tiny army though. Not big, gigantic, scary force army. So they'll be easy to crush. Gives us some... Gives us some... Uh, just have to make sure I crush them quickly enough before the big bad army comes in and tries to do something. Okay, so let's see. You guys are all ready. You guys are all done. Okay. Okay, yep, they're definitely taking the bait. I knew they would. The two... It's too much the British style to not try again. So what I'm going to do is get the best defender that we can possibly get here. Hopefully my people know how to defend. Good. We have one guy who knows how to defend. Okay. You will stay right here and just basically make sure you guys don't collapse. You guys are going to arrive there the 17th. If I get these guys, when will they arrive here? The 16th. They'll be slightly earlier. They're still going to attack me, so... And actually, do you have an attack modifier? So actually, I want to wait a turn, then go. Alright. You're almost there, and this would actually help you with your pathfinding. You, though, on the other hand, uh, just go straight there. We want to make sure that we keep winning these massive battles. 
Seems like are these. I think they might be trying to join that battle, but it's way too late. Oof, we want. We don't want these guys to join. Where are they going? Molten. I can see they're going to Molten. They obviously want something, but I don't know what. Okay. 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 We're gonna have to end this battle quick. Yeah, they're definitely going to where I think they're going. They're going to Lahore. Okay. Send in everyone. Send in every every single soldier we have. If we do not win this battle, we have to gain the advantage. That's basically what I'm saying. We have to gain the advantage and quickly start slaughtering every single one of them. Okay, good. Okay, now that we gain the advantage. <sighs> negative six. Good. Okay. Now that we have the advantage against them again. Um, we have some other British troops over there. We could possibly get to that army. Um, definitely not going to try to attack that army. That would definitely stink. Going to spread out a little bit. Like just a little bit on the front. Let's see. How would that do in defense? Hills to provide some defense. Actually, I'm going to use you guys. To go around and take over that. Okay. Yeah, I'm not really telling you guys, like, really, really... I'm sorry if I'm not really commentating about, like, what I'm going to do and all that kind of stuff. I'm really, 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 really focused on winning this. I mean... I'm basically proving in this campaign that you can win against the Great British. Um, it's not impossible to do a Paneb Let's Play. It really isn't. You just have to be. The, you just have to have dedication and really, really good martial skills. Okay, so they're gonna go after my capital. Actually, then I'll keep my soldiers right here, and we're just gonna do exactly the same strategy. So let's see. Do we have our great commander in, in front of defense? Yes, we have our great commander. Okay. They're going to get to the 15th. Let's see. If we attack right there, 19th, 18th. Let's see. Are they still going to attack? Nope. Okay. Well, we do want them to... the backing off. That's actually good. So let's see if we can... Let's see. That's going to leave the 23rd. They're going to be out the 19th. Okay. That's good. We're going to slowly but surely inch our way back into our own land. Okay. Okay, oh, I know where they're going. They're going to right here, but that wouldn't actually be a very good defensive spot. Oh, I'm going to move my soldiers right there. Okay, this is the last, apparently this is the last big army they have, which is, well, at least the ones that deployed in India. As long as they don't send in any overseas troops, we should be fine. So I'm just going to move some of my troops outward a little bit so we can start making some more stuff. Yeah, you see, I kind of figured they would do that. I'm just going to kind of reconquest all of this. Yeah, this should definitely give us some negative war score. The fact that I keep reconquesting, yeah, in negative 8%. Oh my goodness, this war with India. This war with Great Britain is really stressful. But this should be really, 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 really helpful. Because if the war going good enough, I can do this. Which I bet none of you guys thought I would do. But I think this was my ultimate plan. But I have to make sure the war is going... I don't want that. I want United Provinces of... Of this. Actually, I could try to free the people of India. You know, would it technically count if I freed the people of India? And then just, you know, transferred over vassalage to this? I mean, would that to count? Nah, probably not. But what I'm going to try to do is... In this one attack, with this prestige, if we can get it, if we can, I'm not saying we can, but if we can, I'm going to try to basically reconquer um, some of India. Okay, so they're going after, of course, my lovely capital. Send in both these guys. That should be enough. 22, 24, and I'm going to just send in my big gigantic staples of armies. Stables 25. Yeah, bring it on. Oh, you're still ready? It obviously means you guys have... Okay, I'm going to wait. I'm just going to have to... I'm reconquesting all of this. Okay, let's do that. Kill off some more of them. Kill off some more. Okay, that evens it out. Oh, I'm going to need my other men. I'm going to so need my other men. Come on, finish up, finish up, finish up, finish up. Okay. You have a good attack bonus, right? Go! 
Go! This is probably the last British army. If we can do this, we win the war. No way. <laughs> yes! Okay. Chase them. Chase them. Do not let them reach seed. Do not let them receive. You guys, go this way. We're going to go take on that army over there. That way we can completely push our British in every single direction. Okay, th this is a crucial moment. If we can get this all right, we are... Oh, wait, Barnacles. If I attack that, that's going to... That's not... That's not... They, did, they didn't retreat out of... No, no, stop. You guys go there. You guys go there. You guys do not attack. But you got and the reason why is because unless they were completely broke okay, can we make oh are my guys gonna be making it there in time? Let's see it. Amistad guys are gonna make it there the nineteenth. These guys are gonna make it there. Make it March. Right, in March. Yeah, no. You guys don't do it. You guys start moving this way. Yeah, we could do that. Yeah, because they're going to be out the 19th. And at the most, we should be able to... 17th. Yeah, everyone's going to be out. The Fraser troops are going to be able to take over what we need. Okay, but yeah. The long-term goal is that I will be able to fight against... Take a little bit of India this time in this war. In fact, I need to. Otherwise, things won't work out logically for my plan. And... Right now, I should probably go use these guys to go help with the, uh... Okay, you guys go engage them, just so we can gain some more time. Alright. Whoever they... As long as they don't attack Fit Dover, we should be fine. They're attacking Fit Dover. Alright, well. We definitely can't let them win, so... Everyone, time to do a mass attack again. You try to finish up your rest of your conquest before we do that. Uh, actually, that's not going to be able to finish. Let's see. Clay. Let's see how much they gain a turn. Okay, we're obviously taking faster. We have 32 more soldiers coming in. There we go. Yes! Okay, that looks like an injured army. Go! Go, my men! Go! Kill as many as you can. Okay, you guys go over there. Yes. Okay. Just go as fast as you can. Do not let them... Yeah, 15 soldiers we can deal with. Never mind. 15 soldiers is definitely something we cannot deal with. I don't know why I was doing this, but... You know what? It's done. We're losing so much men from this. Okay, how are we doing over here? They moved. That's good. We're going to kind of pinpoint them right here. That way they can't do anything. Oh, they can move through Persia, of course. Okay, well, 52k soldiers versus 7,000. We are almost losing. That is really almost sad, guys. Yeah, th this battle is going to cost us a lot. In the long term, though, do I think it's worth it? Heck yeah. Okay, because now... Okay. You guys try to beat the British over there. Um, because now... Okay, I'm just going to combine you guys because you guys are pretty beat up. Because right now we have a complete advantage to the British sphere of influence. We have 13 negative war score. I mean, that's pretty bad. We got a couple more men coming after them. Okay, I'm hoping that they'll be able to do this. If not, then I'm just going to have to go send in more men. Oi. Hopefully I can conquer more before I have to go send in more men. Well, you guys can do whatever you want. I'm going to go send in back these guys. Okay. Let's see. They're hitting much more modifiers than us. We're going to be able to take over a couple regions before they finish that. Oh, that's kind of... Oh, now they mobilize. Shoot. Um. <laughs> okay, now they consider us a threat. Yay. Wait. Oh, no, no, no. They're fighting against the... Uh, they're fighting against the Ottomans. That's why. Okay. Okay, that makes sense. I was like, yay, we actually are considered a threat! No, they just are fighting for different reasons. Okay, well, we have to just destroy this army to make sure it never comes back to haunt us. Because if, if this comes back to haunt us, we definitely will have a bad time. I mean, this definitely is something we cannot let happen. My soldiers are rushing over there as fast as possible to try to reconquer some land. And to make sure these guys don't try to interfere. I don't think those guys are going to interfere, honestly. 
Okay, we almost have the strict advantage. And now we're just starting to hit good modifiers. That's good. Okay. Delphi. The future cap... Well, I'm going to try to make it the future capital of us, but you never know what's going to happen, okay? So let's see, do that. I'm going to try to rush this one because I'm pretty sure this is just all extensive men. Um, let's see, these guys, it's going to take them a really long time before they'll be able to do anything. I'll be able to do a couple conquests in between. And now the tide is completely turned against the British. Unless they start sending in the 100,000 death stacks. Oh, lag, lag. Please, please, do not. Gonna stop the recording now. 